I had a request to do a quick step-by-step -step on the dual layer that I like using for when I play Imagine. So I just turned it on. There's nothing been done to it. So we're on Grand Piano 1. Okay. Press dual one time. And that turns on its default dual, which gives you a string. Now press it again, but hold it down for a second, and you'll see this screen turn to D voice. Now you're changing that dual layer's voice. So it says it's on chamber 51, that's the string sound. And we're going to put that over to sweet soprano 67. And then that's basically what I had going on on the video when I did the Imagine one. You can do other little things like press the function button here. Function and then up and down arrows here. And you can adjust how loud you want the volume of the saxophone by raising that so you get a little more. So if I, like, you, the piano is now pretty, it's still pretty low compared to where the sax is. And now you got. Or you can, from D volume, lower that a little bit. And now have the piano high. And so you've got the sax just faintly there. I like the sax kind of even with the piano. Now 63 I'm liking. And then I also said in the other video you can do some stuff with... Uh, the reverb. I wouldn't play with the reverb on the sax. I would hit the down arrow till it says the M. That's your master. That's your first voice player. I might add a little reverb to the piano. So M reverb. I might turn that up. Mm, 65 maybe. just a little quick step-by-step -step on how to get the dual layer balance and how that was done.